Hi everyone. Today I'll be telling you something about. Okay, here is Rich Web Rich. So let me introduce myself. I'm called Dheeraj Kumar Chha. You can call me Dheeraj. I'm a software developer at the Maya Times, Apka Nepal, if you know it. I work as a freelancer. How many of you know what a freelancer is? Okay. Uh, let me tell you, a freelancer, he's a self-sustained guy who can work individually on his project or he can even work on groups uh, there are no certain boundaries S like uh, you don't have a boss right there sitting behind you telling you what to do or what not to do blogger if you have any concept I'm sorry for this keep the current okay uh, well regarding blogger if you know blogs it's called actually it's called weblogs so you have certain pages, certain uh, domain on the web uh, where you can put up your content uh, whatever it comes into your mind uh, anything, anything technical, anything um, literature, whatever so you have some content you want to put it, you want to, some presence on the internet web so you can do it right there and it's called blogger so you are a blogger okay fine, oh, how often do you blog? Or how often should I blog? If you if you question me, uh, I would say once a day, twice a day. Depends upon your time, reach your content. What do you have to uh, put on the web today? It's all depend totally dependent upon you. And sometimes what happens is, uh, say you are you have very good content. You are your content reads. And uh, now the people will uh, start following you and they'll be asking you some questions, you'll be answering them into your domain knowledge. Depending upon what you know, uh, they'll be asking you some sensible questions and it's your liability to answer them. And an ICT consultant, oh well, information communication technology, there's some I have some clients of mine has any problem, they directly come to me, uh, they can call me. Uh, I have certain time rules. They can call me at that time. During that time, I don't charge them at all. Uh, I just answer them on on the call. Basically, uh, I suggest them. And if there is uh, anything that I have to pay for it, I'll ask to charge as well. Oh well, in these discussions, uh, what are we going to discuss? To be confined, I have prepared some content kind of list. Uh, uh, sorry again. What is internet? Mm -hmm. How internet works? Regarding we're talking all about that. What is World Wide Web? www Internet. How it functions? I mean, uh, who are the cute old players? Then browsers. With the browsers, you can browse your internet. Uh, many of you know that. Why internet? Okay, right now at this point, I need your feedback. I'll be coming to this point and I'll be asking you your feedbacks uh, after discussing what internet is and why internet are most important. Technology involves web pages creations. Okay, uh, regarding web pages, if I tell you, web pages are the pages which you go and uh, type any URL in the web browser, then you get some pages, and in those pages, it has many technologies involved. One called HTML, hypertext markup language, CSS, cascading style sheets. Okay, never mind. You don't have to mug it up. Uh, I'll be calling all that again and again. JavaScript, Ajax. Uh, we have JScript as well, uh, which is missing right here. Ajax, PHP. Ajax is asynchronous JavaScript and XML. Uh, here you have ASP, Active Server Pages, depend, uh, totally uh, governed by Microsoft, JSP Java Server Pages, totally governed by Sunbuddies, PSP, it's an open community, jQuery, it's a JavaScript library again, Motools, again a library of JavaScript, Mustang, library, UI, again a library. But they are all 
the libraries when I talk about libraries many of you have um, from C background you must be knowing about what template works for us what are template libraries how they work and uh, in this case libraries of JavaScript is a bit advanced level of JavaScript which again oh god it's troubling me fine client side behaviors client side behaviors will uh, definitely take you to mm -hmm. client side behaviors okay just a second uh, well here we have a client side behaviors hmm. client side behaviors so it's again totally dependent upon the client side that means the browser which fetches the content you when you are browsing some net then you'll be working as a client hmm. so you are the client and the server side means definitely a server guy will be there will be fetching your pages from behind the scene okay with all that concept then we'll be talking about what job prospectives are if you are in web uh, what kind of job uh, you'll be uh, looking after or what kind of job uh, is your currency looking after then career in the wave what you can do where you can be placed oh and how jobs nepal okay yes keep an eye on jobs nepal always if you are tech savvy or whatever it's a very good website regarding your so you, you can if you want to check that what kind of hot jobs are there in a society in your technology yes don't forget visiting jobsnepal.com I hope many of you do it earlier okay so far sure good I'll be continuing thank you